The whole is greater than the sum of its parts. What does that mean, this phrase? In the universe, in the world we live, there is different kind of processes. Is the process of adding, like you have water and you add more water and you have more of the same thing. And you have other kind of process, which is the process of fusion, the process of combination. Is a process in which when you combine the, the, the different elements you have, when you combine different things you have, the end result is different than the sum of its parts. So for example, when you bake a cake, this is the process of fusion. So you have, you have a doubt, which is water and flour, and you have mixed it, and you have, you have something, and when you put it in the oven, it becomes a new thing. So the heating and and a 40 minutes time of heating, for example, for a for a cake, it made the this doubt which is liquid and juicy, it becomes a new thing, a different thing. So when you combine this the, the oven heating with the doubt, it becomes a different thing. It has acquired new properties that didn't exist in the elements by separation, right? So this is the meaning of the phrase, the whole is greater than the sum of its parts. Another example would be like um, a house, where what is a house made out of? It's, it just maybe has some wooden in the walls, bricks, it has sand, kind of a sand, made to make the, the bricks to fix one to each other. And the thing is, what are those materials in the nature? It's just kind of sand that you could find in a in any kind of um, road. We we now live in a in a cities where the roads they they put um, the fixed concrete, but in the old time we have sand in the street. So those materials combined in a in a specific way will make to arise bricks, will make arise the walls, and then. What has the what new properties has this material combined it in this specific way? It has a property that can keep the worm inside, because just a wooden or a tree cannot make um, the worm air to stick to it. So when you get close to the tree, ah, oh, it's worm. No, but when you put, when you cut the the wooden parts from the tree, when you combine with the bricks, the sun, then you get this enclosed space and then the work is inside. So new properties arise and this is the whole is more than the sum of its parts. If you will put just together the wood and the sun and the bricks with no specific combination like the one is to make the room, to make the house, then you haven't got any result, any, any result that has the property of keeping the one inside. So this is the meaning of this phrase, new properties arise and you get a new result.